can ignore the harsh backlight, but I wanted to share something cool happening in the Portland area. We're having a wonderful sunny day, and it's great to get back in the shop and get some work done. I'm cutting mortise and tenon joints on two cherry quilt chests that I started a while ago. I actually had to put these aside for a while because things got a little hectic in our house. I also had a chance to put some finish on this cherry display shelf that I'm building. Thanks for coming into the shop. I really enjoyed the visit. I also have made a small guide block so that I can cut all my rails at the same time, just sliding this up in place. And again, with the um, sight bar, that gives me my top alignment. This gives me my end alignment. And then just clamp it in place. Slide the bar out of the way, and I'm ready to go. Alright, so that's the uh, plunge routing of the mortise, and you can see it's a pretty good uh, mortise, nice and clean. Pretty good fit. Okay, so I just finished routing the mortise, and I thought I'd show you how that portion of the jig works. Again, on the bottom of the jig, you can see there's an alignment pin. There's actually two of these. This, this one on the uh, far end just rides in a straight groove. The one that does the real work is this pin right here on the left side of the machine. Again, riding in this template system. So just to clarify, riding on this center index with the pin cuts the mortise in the respective piece and then riding the pin around the outside of this guide cuts the tenon on its respective piece. Well, it was a pretty productive day. I got all the mortise and tenons cut for two cherry quilt chests and looking forward to the next part of the process, cutting the grooves for the panels and getting the panels cut and then assembly. Mm -hmm.